happen. I'm it's not, not it's I, not, I, I it's not thing. like an, hold on. It's not like an earthly thing, how you, your wife brings a baby. So you know how you do dingy dingy with your wives and she brings a baby? That's not how we look at it. No. Okay. It's totally different. God is totally different than us. You know, he's outside of the space. He's totally different. That's what I need you to, to understand. Okay. Go ahead. Continue. I just invited you to unmute yourself. Go ahead. Yeah. So, uh, I'm going to speak in Arabic just for this thing. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead in English, like, please, because the life is in English. Okay. Yeah. No, it's in English, but I'm going to ask you in Arabic and you can then, because I don't know how no, to No, 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 no. Okay. You, well, what? that's not my fault. You go ahead and speak yeah. English, brother. No, pray. Like when he put his head in the... Wow. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Okay. When he fall, when he put his head down and he started praying, right? Yeah. Okay. You see, does God pray to him? On, does God pray to his own self? Like I'm praying to my own self. Sure. Let me go ahead and explain this. Awesome. This is a good uh, verse, guys. He brought up what an amazing verse. When Jesus went and he was teaching the disciples, you know, while he was on earth, you know, he because he has a divine nature. You know, which is the fully man and fully God. When he was on earth and he submitted his will to the Father and he was praying to the Father. Okay, what did he say? Abba, Baby, Father. He didn't say Allah. That's that. Second thing is, before Islam exists, mm -hmm. Orthodox used to pray that way. They used to, until now, they still pray. Orthodox Christian. Christian Orthodox. They still put their head down and they pray the way that Muslim prays. Why? Because they used to pray that already back then. You guys came and copied it from them. Okay, mm -hmm. that's that. Another uh, thing is, another uh, thing is, okay, he was teaching them how to pray. That's first. Secondly is, he was communicating with the Father because there's a distinction in between. You know, he was uh, communicating with the Father and everything. So that doesn't, uh, you know, debunk uh, the argument. But go ahead. Okay. I another question. Yeah. Why, why would God put Himself as a human to and struggle like we struggle? Can we, can we stick to the topic? You're moving out of the topic right now. You're moving the goalpost, and oh, it's not I'm gonna happen. A couple of questions. If you don't want to answer, you can just escape. No, 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 no. Okay. Because you're when moving out. Of, question, you can. It. You can, listen. You're diverting from the topic. All I'm speaking is right now is regarding the topic. If you don't want to speak regarding the topic then I have to move on to the next person. Not because I'm scared, not because I don't want to answer your questions. No, your questions are the easiest questions ever. Even baby Christian could answer them. But I have a topic that I want to speak about. I don't want to divert from the topic. So if you want to speak regarding the topic, go ahead and uh, do that. Okay, I'm asking you about God, about Jesus. If you're saying that Jesus is a God, or he's... Or he's or... I just told you to stick to the topic. Do you understand what sticking to the topic is? Bruh. I'm I'm literally sticking to the topic that no, you're recently... not. we're talking about if Jesus is Muslim or not. Now you're talking about you're you're okay. talking about the divinity okay. of, of God, okay. divinity of Jesus Christ. Okay, then I'm gonna tell you. We it's an ayah in uh, in Quran. Like if you wanna hear it, let me just say it. I don't care about the Quran. I want you to prove it. Oh, me. Bro, I want you to prove it outside the Quran because because respect. respectfully hold yeah. on, respectfully I don't take a Quran as a true book. Why? Because it came after the Christianity. Why should I rely on something, some book that came after Christianity when Jesus was already there and he came and fulfilled the prophecies, yeah. walked the earth, he was uh, crucified and died on the third day and resurrected after that. Why should I do that? So now okay. I'm asking if you can prove you, it. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you why you should. If you, you should. could prove me, if, if you could prove it, Outside of the Quran, even if you bring me a chapter verse from the Bible, no problem. Or even historical evidence, I will still huh? take it. Okay, I'm going to tell you one of your verses. I don't know in which testament, but it says sure. that, that there is a prophet that's going to come after me. He's going to be the last prophet. Show me. Okay, I'm going to just let me search it up. Give me a second. Okay, chapter and verse, ya Allah. Let me think, what is it? Song of uh, Solomon? Is that what he's going to go to, guys? What do you guys think? Probably, huh? Or Deuteronomy 18.18, if I'm not mistaken. Mm, let me see. Let me see what else. Uh, yeah, we'll see. 
Mark 1-7. Mark 1-7? Yep. One of the uh, preserved lines of Jesus' gospel, they say oh. Mark 1-7, where Jesus... Mark 1 -7? Yep. Wow. So what does this prove? That there is a prophecy after after Jesus. In the New Testament? Bro, I don't know which testament. Did Jesus said that? Bro, where Jesus supposedly, uh, pro what is it? Prophesied wow. of Muhammad. There Where does it say Muhammad that will come after me? Where did Jesus say that Muhammad will come after me? He said that there will be a prophecy after me. There will be Bro, a prophecy after me? Let's read it. Let's read it. Okay, can, you, can you please read it? Okay, Mark 1 I would seven. like you to read it, please, please. And then uh, open up ESV or, K, uh, or KJV. Hmm? What did you say? Open up KJV or ESV when you read the uh, verse. Okay. Uh -huh. There comes after me. He's the mighter uh -huh. than I. Mark 1 7. And then who is this talking about? You said Muhammad? Yeah. Oh, Allah, my brothers and sisters. Wow, I didn't know that Muhammad is in the Bible, is in the New Testament, everybody. Interesting. Wow, you just got me, bro. I don't know what to say anymore. Bro, I didn't... Why did you do that to me? Bro, I didn't say no shit. It says in your own fucking Bible. Oh, 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 watch after... watch your mouth, bro. Watch your mouth. Can you please oh, watch yeah. your mouth? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, bro. Yeah. There okay. comes after me, he's the mitre, the knight. Uh -huh. What does okay. that mean? Can you explain it to me if you if you yes. know that much? Um, I don't know, bro. You, you Like I said, you just got me. You just proved me otherwise, bro. Wow. Guys, Muhammad is in the New Testament. And Jesus is talking about Muhammad and telling him that he will come after me. Wow. But now, didn't say let the me name ask you one question. Let me, let me ask you a question. Sure. Who is Who is speaking? Over here, you can call me Khalid. No, 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 no. I'm not saying you. I'm saying who's speaking in this verse, in this uh, uh, chapter. Uh, I don't know. Jesus. Jesus. It says Jesus said to her, "Woman, <laughs> believe me, the hour is coming when when oh, you will yeah. gather from this mountain." Listen, bro. This is why you guys are deceived in the brain because this is John the Baptism. It's talking about Jesus. Okay, it's not talking about your own Muhammad. Bro, you guys like to find a way to butcher the scripture and go and decay and say, oh, Muhammad is over there. Look, everybody, I found him. I found him, mashallah. No, that's not how it goes, brother. It's John the Baptist. It's talking about Jesus Christ, speaking in regard of Jesus Christ. Where do you, I mean, where do you see uh I'm going to ask Muhammad? you a question. How how will a Bible have another man's word in the, in own of Jesus? Because they're book. authors, because he's speaking of regard. So you're uh, telling me there's more than an author in your own book. You're telling me there's... Listen, listen, listen when you have... <laughs> oh my God, bro, I've never seen this. When you see, when your ahadith, mm -hmm. okay, says okay. the chain of narration by this guy, and Muhammad spoke, was it Muhammad that wrote that? Nah, see, the hadith is different from Quran. That's a... Wait, is the hadith divine revelation as well? Bro, wait. Hadith is way different. Hadith is way different. Hadith is about Sahaba. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. hadith is about Sahaba, not the it's life of the Prophet? Sahaba. Can you wait and listen till the end? At this man, is it, bro, is it life I'm, of the I'm prophet? Aliya hayat al Nabi, yes or no? Yeah, it's it's about it's the, the life of the prophet, right? Yeah, but it's not written in the Quran. There's a difference. There's another book. I understand. I understand. I'm yeah. asking you: Is it divine revelation when Muhammad is speaking? Yeah. Regarding that, exactly. The hadith is divine revelation. Quran is divine revelation. Does the hadith has authors like as far as like chain of narration in that hadith? If it's authentic, yes, it does. There we go. But hadith isn't. What's a the problem? Book? Wait, I'm gonna tell you what's the problem. 
you in your own holy book you have authors in our holy book we don't have, we have authors so what the ones that wrote about no. jesus saw they saw what their eyes wrote didn't you didn't your uh, people inside of that chain of narration they saw the life of the prophet and they were writing about uh, about, about your prophet or was it muhammad literally writing Bro, make it make sense. Bro, in the you're Quran, making yourself look Quran, stupid. In the whole Quran, yes, Muhammad wrote it. No other, no other authors was talking about Muhammad. Wait, the Quran. so the in the Quran, Quran Muhammad wrote the Quran? It was from God sent to Muhammad. So who wrote the Quran? God sent the words to Muhammad, which he wrote. I know, but who wrote the Quran? Like, what do you mean by who wrote the Quran? You, who wrote the Quran? God sent it to Muhammad and he was writing it. He was, he was giving him the verses. That he, uh, okay, he, so basically Allah was giving Muhammad the verses and Muhammad was writing them in the paper. Okay. It wasn't Mashallah. written in paper. MashaAllah. 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 Okay. okay. Thank you for coming up. I appreciate you, bro. I'm going to move on to the next person. Okay? Okay, sure. Okay, <laughs> Habibi.